I've got some trivia for you on words that feature the letter X. This is Trivia with Buds. Welcome to another episode of the Trivia with Buds podcast. I'm your host, Ryan Matthew Buds. That's right. My middle name is Matthew, and my wife spelled Matthew with one T on my passport about 10 years ago when we went on our honeymoon. She, to this day, swears that Matthew is spelled with one T when it is, in fact, spelled with two, unless you live in, like, Lithuania or something. But there's a fun, quick anecdote to kick off this episode on x words if you like scrabble if you like crossword puzzles this type of episode is for you i'll give you some sort of definition or clue and you tell me which word fits the bill that features an x or maybe more than one x before we get to that want to give a big shout out to mark zarate who's not just a patreon subscriber of mine new this week he's also an amazing interviewer and podcast host on his show which is called cool calm and chaotic mark zarate it's in the health and fitness section and you can find it by searching uh, searching cool calm chaotic uh go give it a subscribe if you like health food music and just general great discussions i did an hour and 10 minute episode with him on july 27th this week and uh, you can listen to some fun stories from me including me talking about my daughter winning chicken poop bingo down in Austin, Texas. If that doesn't get you to listen, I don't know what will. Uh, check it out. Cool, Calm, and Chaotic, a fun show with Mark Zarate. We are going to jump into today's episode on X Words, but let's do our Geek Out Challenge card first. Name two films in which an afterlife appears. Name four recurring Saturday Night Live sketches. Name four book titles by Judy Bloom. Name two songs by Johnny Cash. And for miscellaneous, four nicknames for types of pants. Very interesting stuff there. All right, we're going to jump into today's episode on X Words right now. Here we go. All right, here we go with X Words. Number one, an image of a document made by electronic scanning and transmitted as data by telecommunication links. What is that word featuring? The letter X, number one. Now remember, all of these do not start with X. They just feature the letter X, number one. Number two, a natural gas company with the stock symbol XOM. Natural gas company with the stock symbol XOM. Number three, Gertrude Chandler Warner wrote the first 19 stories featuring this family of children living in a unique abode. Number three. Number four, a small triangular bone at the base of the spinal column in humans and some apes. Number five, a fillet of brined salmon. A filet of brined salmon. Number six, a studio album by System of a Down. A studio album by System of a Down. Number seven, the B in LGBTQ+. Number seven, the B in LGBTQ+. Number eight, a form of vocal percussion primarily involving the art of mimicking drum machines. Number nine, a sitcom with Danny DeVito and Tony Danza that debuted in 1978. Number 10, a brand name for a series of fitness training equipment marketed and sold by Nautilus Incorporated. And the bonus for two points, a neurological disorder characterized by the inability to perform learned familiar movements on command, even though the command is understood and there's a willingness to perform the movement. What is the term for that condition? 
Those are all your questions for X words. All the answers contained in X somewhere. We'll be back with the answers after this. X marks the spot, and I've got the answers on the map to your trivia treasure. Number one, an image of a document made by electronic scanning and transmitted as data by telecommunication links. One of the lamest things in 2022 when someone goes, can you fax it? I'm like, no, I don't even want to work with somebody that only wants a fax. It's the dumbest thing of all time. Uh, of course, in the 90s, it was great. But now, we'll get with the program. Number one is fax. Number two, a natural gas company with a stock symbol, XOM, Exxon, E-X-X-O-N, Exxon. Number three, Gertrude Chandler Warner wrote the 19 stories, the first 19, featuring the family of children living in a unique abode, boxcar children. They solve mysteries boxcar children number four a small triangular bone at the base of the spinal column in humans and some aches apes the coccyx 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 c-o-c-c-y-x number five a filet of brine salmon is lox lox number six a studio album by system of a down toxicity number seven the b and lgbtq plus bisexual bisexual Number eight, a form of vocal percussion, primarily involving the art of mimicking drum machines, beatboxing, boots and cats and boots and cats. Number nine, a sitcom with Danny DeVito and Tony Danza that debuted in 1978, Taxi. And number 10, a brand name for a series of fitness training equipment from Nautilus Incorporated, Bowflex, Bowflex. Number 11, the neurological disorder where you cannot move even though you want to, apraxia, apraxia. A-P-R-A-X-I-A. -A -A. And there you have it, another episode of Fun Trivia Knowledge from me, your pal, Ryan Buds. So many cool things going on this week and all around Northeast Tennessee for Harry Potter's birthday. Check out my website, TriviaWithBuds.com, if you live near me and want to come play some Harry Potter trivia at places like State Street Brewing and uh, downtown Elizabethton and uh, all over the place. Check it out, TriviaWithBuds.com. Also, signing Sharknado headshots and doing some shark trivia at Tiebreakers in Johnson City, Tennessee on Saturday from 3 to 6 p.m. for the signing and Sunday, 6 to 9 p.m. It's a great new Dave & Buster's style place with really good food and, and amazing cocktails and drinks. So come check it out and a lot of fun games, axe throwing, bowling, virtual reality. Tiebreakers has it all. Check them out, Tiebreakers, Johnson City, Tennessee. Also, fun new announcements coming over on the next couple of episodes. So make sure you listen to the whole episode if you want to hear what's going on with the show and uh, new features, new types of episodes on the way. You know, I like to switch it up. I can't do the same thing for too long. And uh, we've got some new features coming. So be on the lookout for those. Thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. Oh, wait, hold on. We got a fact of the day. I almost forgot. Everyone loves the fact of the day. And today's is a 10 gallon hat holds less than a gallon of liquid. There you have it. Uh, thanks for listening. Thanks for telling a friend. We'll see you next time for more Trivia with Buds. Cheers. Cheers.